Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Wednesday, the seventh day of September 2022. Our topic today is constant inquiry, a pathway to greatness. The Bible says, But thus says the Lord, Stand ye in the ways, and see, and ask for the old path, wherein is the good way, and walk therein, and ye shall find rest for your soul. But ye say, We will not walk therein. Jeremiah 6 16. Thought for the day. Divine direction is the backbone of spiritual conquerors. One way to learn the principles of greatness is to look at the life of great men. David in scripture was an enviable great man who walked with God in his time. And one attribute of David was an attitude of inquiry. David would always inquire from God before he made any move. At different occasions, when David was involved in battle with the Philistines, he would inquire of the Lord. At one point, God would tell him to go and fight the Philistines. But at another point, God would tell him not to go. You see that in 2 Samuel 5, 17 to 25. Do you know the reason why David did not lose any battle? It was because he always asked God questions. Divine direction is the backbone of spiritual conquerors. You will not miss it another time in Jesus name. God's servant Papa Oyedepo said that when they were given the certificate for the opening of the Covenant University, everyone was rejoicing but he was not happy. So he held the certificate in his hands and said, Oh Lord, are you in this or are we just uh, trying to open a, a university? If you are not in it, I will tear this certificate now. And God said, I am the one. Go ahead. You see, the attitude of inquiry is a character of great men. Our counsel is refuse to embark on any project until you have received approval from God. Don't be in a hurry to do anything until you have gotten go ahead from God. Remember this, divine direction is the backbone of spiritual conquerors. I see you going up in the name of Jesus. What's our assignment today? Number one, maintain an attitude of inquiry always. Number two, don't take a step until God gives you a go ahead. Praise the Lord. Let's pray together today. Say after me, thank you, Lord, for your word to me today. I receive the grace to maintain a constant attitude of inquiry. Oh, Lord, in Jesus' name. Praise God. Hallelujah. Well, I'd like to pray for you. You can't inquire of who doesn't have a relationship with you. So to be able to inquire and know God's direction all the time, assuredly, you need to be born again. Simply pray this prayer after me. I mean it from the depth of your heart. Say, Jesus, please come into my life. Wash away my sins. I know I'm a sinner. I need your help. Please forgive me all my sins and make me a new person. In Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. The Lord bless and keep you and cause his face to shine on you in Jesus' name. I'd like to pray for you today. It's your birthday. I wish you a very happy birthday. As your days are, so shall your strength be. God cause his face to shine on you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. You are blessed. Have your most glorious day in Jesus' name.